Here we would like to demonstrate implant removal if the implant is damaged. Now what we will do, we will snap off the head of a screw and we will demonstrate how we can use different instruments in order to remove the screw. So I want you to take the screwdriver and snap off one of these heads. So now we have the problem of having to remove the screw. We have to make room around the screw in order to be able to extract it. We do that with this instrument here. We have prepared this in order to make it a little easier. So I want you to take this instrument and I want you to try to drill around the screw in order to make room for the actual instrument with which we will extract the screw. I am removing some of the bone around the screw. The instrument is pushed firmly against the bone and rotated counterclockwise. If necessary, remove any debris around the screw with a sharp hook. When you use the instrument, go all the way through the near cortex. We have enough room for the instrument with which we will now extract. This is the instrument with which we extract. I would like for you to place this on the screw and turn it counterclockwise, putting a lot of pressure on it. And once it is solid, then just turn the screw out. Here you are. Pressure and counterclockwise. Okay, now see if it is solid. That's right. We have engaged the instrument onto the screw. You see? By turning it counterclockwise, we engage the instrument into the metal of the screw, and then we can turn it out. Here, the screw head is damaged so that I cannot remove it, as you can see. No matter how I use the screwdriver, I cannot extract the screw. I have this instrument which lodges into the screw head so that there is a very, very tight connection between the screw head and the instrument. I need some pressure in order to apply this and really engage the instrument into the screw. You see, now it is engaged and I can just turn And by turning this, I can remove the screw. So now let us discuss the results of this exercise and what you can learn. In the online faculty support packages, you can find faculty guides for each station and, where appropriate, topics for discussion and frequently asked questions. In case of questions, please send an email to templates at aotrauma.org.